92nd Street Y online media is made possible by the generous support of listeners like you. This program features Dylan Thomas reading from Under Milkwood. It was recorded on May 14, 1953, before a live audience at New York's 92nd Street Y. The beginning at the beginning. It is spring moonless night in the small town. Starless and Bible black, the cobble streets silent, and the hunched quarters and rabbits wood limping invisible down to the slow black, slow black, crow black fishing boat bobbing sea. The houses are blind as moles, though moles see fine tonight in the snouting velvet dingle. Or blind as Captain Cat, there in the muffled middle by the pump and the town clock, the shops in mourning, the welfare hall in widow's wheels. And all the people of the loud and dumbfound town are sleeping now. Hush, the babies are sleeping, the farmers, the fishers, the tradesmen and pensioners, cobblers, school teacher, postman and publican, the undertaker and the fancy woman, drunkard, dressmaker, preacher, policeman, the webfoot cockle women and the tidy wives. Young girls lie bedded soft or glide in their dreams with rings and trousseaus. Brides mated by glowworms down the aisles of the organ playing wood. The boys are dreaming wicked or of the bucking ranches of the night and the jolly Roger Sea. And the anthracite statues of the horses sleep in the fields and the cows in the byres and the dogs in the wet nosed yards and the cats nap in the slant corners. All loaps lie streaking and needling on the one cloud of the roof. You can hear the dew falling and the hushed town breathing. Only your eyes are unclosed to see the black and folded town fast and slow asleep. And you alone can hear the invisible star fall, the darkest before dawn, minutely dew-grazed stir of the black, dab-filled sea, where the Arethusa, the Curlew, and the Skylark, Phoebe and Sally and Mary Ann, Zanzibar, Rhiannon, the Rover, the Cormorant, and the Star of Wales, tilt and ride. Listen. It is night moving in the streets, the processional salt, slow musical wind in Coronation Street and Cockle Row. It is the grass growing on Theregub Hill, dewfall, starfall, the sleep of birds in Milkwood. Listen. It is night in the chill squat chapel hymning in bonnet and brooch and bombazine black, butterfly choker and bootlaced bow, coughing like nanny goats sucking mintos, forty winking hallelujah. Night in the four ale bar, quiet as a domino, in Oki Milkman's loft, like a mouse with gloves, in dye bread's bakery, flying like black flowers. Listen, it is tonight in Donkey Street, trotting silent with seaweed on its hooves, along the cockled cobbles, past curtain, fern pot, text and trinket, harmonium, holy dresser, watercolors done by hand, china dog and rosy tin tea caddy. It is night, neddying among the snuggeries of babies. Look. It is night, dumbly, royally, winding through the coronation cherry trees, going through the graveyard of Bethesda with wind gloved and folded and dew dust, tumbling by the sailor's arms. Time passes. Listen. Time passes. Come closer now.
Only you can hear the houses sleeping in the streets in the slow, deep, salt and silent, black, banded night. Only you can see in the blinded bedrooms the combs and petticoats over the chairs, the jugs and basins, the glasses of teeth. Thou shalt not on the wall and the yellowing dicky bird watching pictures of the dead. Only you can hear and see behind the eyes of the sleepers the movements and countries and mazes and colors and dismays and rainbows and tunes and wishes and flight and fall and despairs and big seas of their dreams. From where you are, you can hear their dreams. Thanks for listening. 92nd Street Y, Unterberg Poetry Center webcasts, and access to our archive are made possible by the generous support of listeners like you. For more information on 92nd Street Y and all our programs, please visit us on the web at 92y.org. This program is copyright 1953 by 92nd Street Y.